Hi folks, today I want to talk about a very reliable rumor that has been published by Fuji Rumors and it's a rumor about a quite unique camera we truly have never seen before like this. It will be a sort of digital version of the very famous panoramic cameras from Fujifilm, the TX1 and the TX2. Those were film cameras and now it looks like that Fujifilm will make a digital version of that that will arrive in 2028. Now. I realize that 2028 is still far out and you might think that uh, this is very speculative as of now, but Fuji rumors has been proven to be very reliable also on long-term rumors, so I'm pretty certain that Fujifilm will do that camera and that we're getting this digital panoramic camera. This is quite a big news in the industry because we don't have something like this. There are some early rumors coming out from Fujirumors.com, so we don't know yet how exactly the camera will be, for example, named, how it will look what the specs will be. I guess it could be named TX3 in honor of the previous film cameras. Those were 65 per 24 millimeter film cameras and we don't know if the sensor size will be similar to the film size. I don't think so but maybe Fujifilm will do it. But Fuji Rumors reports that a Fujifilm still hasn't decided if they will use the Bayer sensor tech or the X-Trans sensor tech on this camera. If they are going for the Bayer sensor, they will basically use the GFX sensor and crop it. If they will decide to use the X-Trans sensor, then they will basically use their current APS-C sensor technology at double the sensor area so that you get the panoramic image. So basically you will have two APS-C sensors side by side. So let me know in the comment system and what you would love to get but uh, that's all we know so far so um, I, the rest is purely speculative so we don't know for example if this will be a fixed lens camera or an interchangeable lens camera what the sensor size will be and I really don't know also if there is a market for this because this is going to be an expensive model I don't know if there are many people interested in getting a panoramic camera most of the people when they take panoramic shots, they just have the full frame or medium format camera and then make the crops and that's good enough. Also seeing the resolution of, the, for example, the Fujifilm GFX cameras, you can do that without any problem. So I doubt this will be a mass seller. I doubt this will be a huge success. But sometimes companies do certain niche cameras also for prestige uh, to get some... Um, interest uh, from uh, reviewers, influencers, and to make a statement to say like we can do this. So this might be helpful as a sort of uh, beacon project to drive more interest in general in the Fujifilm uh, cameras. Anyway, let me know what you think about this camera. If you are one of the few that would consider to buy it, what kind of specs you would love to get. And as soon as Fuji Rumors will share some more details about this camera, I will make a new video. But um, I want an important reminder, a camera that is really coming soon from Fujifilm is the XM5 entry-level camera. So this will have also the film simulation dial of the XT50. And in probably in early 2025, we will get the first fixed lens medium format camera from Fujifilm. So as usual, Fujifilm does a ton of cameras every year. So there is going to be an exciting time if you love Fujifilm cameras. Folks, um, if you like this video, like the YouTube video so that I get some boost in the YouTube algorithm. Also subscribe to the channel and see you soon.